Alrighty guys, we are back in another Factorio workshop. As always, I am here with Matsuri. Greetings. And we have something we have actually never gone over before in this series, I don't believe. Uh, we have a Destroyer Capsule um, production build here, submitted by uh, Medish? Medish? I, I'm, I'm so bad with names, and it's one of those ones I'm not sure how to pronounce correctly, but hopefully I got it right. Anyway, um, we, we have this build, and it has one destroyer cap producer in the middle here, which is then supplied by these uh, distractors, which are supplied by the uh, defenders and then the ammo on the outsides, and requests the rest of the materials in. Um, this can do a little bit less than five a minute, because um, with a crafting speed of 1.25, um, it would be five a minute, except there's actually a little underproduction here. Um, which will go over a minute and a little overproduction in some areas, but I'll let Zuri uh, cover the rest of this and just kind of discuss, you know, the overproduction, underproduction, and uh, and stuff like that. Well, for the first part, the Victoria capsules is the correct ratio. You need two, and it has be four of them, and it takes half as long. So, yeah, this is just about right. Yeah, they both take 15 seconds and it takes four to produce. Uh, the problem is this takes eight seconds and you need four of them. If it was 16 and eight, or if it was, you know, eight, uh, 15 and 7.5 or something, it would be perfect, but it's not. So there's a little bit of downtime for the structure capsules. And you're overproducing a bit on... Uh, ammo. Right. This is almost exactly like one of my first builds I ever posted in the Factorial forums. Really? Nice. So, I mean, how, that, that must have been quite a long time ago, right? Oh, yeah. Very long time ago. <laughs> yeah. It's anyone that finds that post. Yeah, so, so there's a task for you guys. Go find uh, Zuri's, one of first uh, Zuri's Destroyer Cat builds. Um, but yeah, so... Excuse me, the ammo overproduction isn't that big of a deal because it will just stop once it has a, stock, a little bit of a stockpile on the machine. As we mentioned, a little bit of downtime here. But overall, um, this produces almost five a minute. And um, it is what you said, Zuri, it's like uh, radio, radially symmetrical. Yes, radially or rotational symmetrical, depending on how you want to say it. Yeah. So um, you can see around here it's symmetrical and uh, uh one quick note though we're just we're gonna have the blueprint in the description as always and it's gonna be the blueprint that um they gave me however you will want to change these requests i think it might have just been a mistake on um on Menish's part uh because these requests are actually a little bit messed up <laughs> um so, first of all, on these ones for the request of circuits and the gears and stuff, there's a double request here. And, and Zuri had a good point. Uh, what we think happened is that they copy-pasted from the machine to here to request this 4 and 6, because it does double the what it needs. And then he also requested, like, set a request in here, and it defaults to a stack size. Um, so you would want to redo this. And then also, I don't think you would need to request ammo since you're already overproducing it. Um, unless you just want to like clear it out of your your logistics system or something, um, and then also this red circuit thing is way 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 over requesting. Um, this is two hundred requesting, even though these only need three every fifteen seconds. So uh, you would want to mess with those a little bit. Just a quick heads up: um, the blueprint will come with these requests because we just want to use the one they submitted. But uh. But yeah, uh, besides messing with that, I mean, it's good, you know, it uses two substations, power pull, power pull, and that's it. It's pretty darn compact. And if we look here, um, once it gets its initial supply, which again would be a, a lot lower if you fix the request, it only uses about, on average, I think about 10 bots. I mean, like right now it's not using any, but once they request... Um, you know, it uses more, but on average, I think it uses about 10 or 20 bots, which is really not that bad. And, uh, and yeah, I mean, do you have any uh, last thoughts or, or comments or improvements here, Zuri? 
Uh, not really. You want to module this? I recommend one speed three and three efficiency three modules. It'll speed it up a bit and not mess with the ratios. All right, very good point. And actually, you you mentioning that just made me realize I think we were wrong that there's actually not a downtime on this because we I just noticed he does have one speed module in one of these machines to make up for that I would presume. Oh, ha, that's awesome. I, I like I, I don't know how we overlooked it. I guess which is everything else going on. Um, so I think this ratio is actually perfect because of this speed module or as close as it can be. Yeah, because this is giving it a 20% boost. Again, that's pretty clever. I like it. <laughs> oh, there you go. Series stamp over pool, then, uh, then yeah, really the only thing you would need to fix is the request, and other than that, great build. So yeah, uh, blueprint in the description, and I believe that'll do it for this one, guys. But uh, until next time, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Any submissions you have, leave them down in the comments, and we will catch you later. Later.